please nighttime what is i think this is literally the second time we've seen nighttime in this show ever since we got into soul society oh oh yeah i forgot she could just heal her own things as well yeah no. she hesitated right Hey, bro, I, nobody's gonna blame you, right? Because at the end of the day, you're just a normal girl who literally, like, two days ago just got these special powers and people are like, hey, now you gotta fight. Oh, so it takes longer to heal themselves. Hey, still better than nothing, right? Nothing for you to apologize, girl. Okay. Damn! See, so she's not even like used to it properly yet, bro, and she's still doing all this shit. He's about to talk shit. Aww. I thought he was gonna talk shit because that's what he always does to her. He remember? <laughs> so, so wasn't there like uh, the captain dude following them last episode? There was, right? I mean, I'm not surprised. She is a very kind person. It's just like, uh, I forgot who I was thinking of. I, I had a brain fart just now. But like, yeah, she's way too... It's, uh, she's like... um, uh, What's her name? From Naruto. The one that has crush on Naruto. Neji's, Neji's cousin, bro. The girl, bro. I fucking love her, bro. But I'm having a brain fart. He not. <laughs> I had to look up all the Naruto character names. <laughs> So she literally reminds me of Hinata, where Hinata's also, she has the power and stuff, right? It seems like, but she's way too kind for her to really fight, fight, right? I mean, she will throw her down if you hurt Naruto or something, right? It seems like, and the same thing here, it seems like, or he may probably is probably the same shit where she might throw it down if you hurt her friends or something, but she's not the best at fighting, right? But she doesn't need to be, right? Because her powers are more of like, it seems like healing shit and defense shit and stuff. I used also put that part out when I had a brain fire. Right? Make me seem smart. Who are you? What's up? Uh, you know, we're just on a patrol. Yeah, just, you know, looking for the Ryokas. Oh, and you said that. Oh, that actually might work out in our favor, huh? Uh -huh. Who the fuck? <sighs> Thank you? Oh, yeah, yeah, how dare he, bro? Yeah, we're one of you people for sure. How dare he die? <laughs> yeah, bunch of fucking assholes. <laughs> we really got out of that. Oh, so are they planning shit? Maybe they're interested in Orihime? What? Oh! Ooh, oh wait! Oh, that mama is just burning, burning! Oh, that's your captain? You have a dude that looks like a fucking snake, Orochimaru 2.0, as your captain, and you expect... That's not what we agreed upon, bro. Uh-huh. The release bomb shouldn't return. Oh, wow, damn, mama does not even see... Oh, bro! He does not even see... Is that even allowed? Bro, Soul Society is fucked up, fucked up. Uh, they're gone. So what happens? Actually, hold up. Real question. When humans die, they get they become spirits and they get transported to Soul Society. What happens when Soul Reapers die? Do they just like reincarnate right after and they're already in Soul Society or they're just, nah, bro, you don't exist no more. Nope, it's not your fault, bro. If anything, you protected us. Look at that, bro. We would have died otherwise. As a research subject, bro. Yeah, no, thank you, bro. I see what happened to the last ones. You literally call them fucking bombs, bro. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, she's just crying because she feels bad for them, bro. Oh, because she's just a kind person, bro. That's all there is to it. Yeah, no, thank you. Also, what the fuck? Mom is got a nail, nail. I mean, I said a nail. What is it called? Nail, right? Yeah, yeah, right? Right? <laughs> I'm having a brain fart. Oh. Oh, 
Damn, Mama's is fast. Nanda. Yeah, we, we kind of did exactly that. <laughs> oh. As well as the second generation chief of research and development. Damn, bro, he's also bro, everybody just everybody in this show is just born just being able to talk shit, huh? No. I mean, we saved your ass, bro. I'll kill you. <laughs> Damn. Oh. Oh, what the hey, yo? Oh. Like we stopped it though. Are we not got uh, literally Orochimaru? <laughs> literally, or, just the robotic version of Orochimaru. I'm not saying they're copying. I'm just saying like they're so fucking like they're brothers, bro. Like just one one went into Naruto universe and one went over here, bro. But like I was saying though, as much as like I appreciate Uyu letting go of uh, Orihime, I just don't know if he's able, gonna be able to fight a whole captain by his dolo. You know what I mean, because Ichigo's done that and he barely got out of it himself. But he's the main character. Oh, wow. <laughs> She's acting like a little kid. Oh, damn. I guess that was for the best, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, yeah, yeah, look. It's like a half android, pretty much. So you got something that pretty much regenerates your shit, huh? Bro, even the way he talks is so is so creepy, bro. Yeah, she's wearing a little badge, right? So she is a lieutenant. Oh, he's fast. Oh, damn, Uri is moving, moving. Oh, no, not fast enough. He's also countering it. I thought for sure the second one got him. Thank you, thank you, bro. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I actually wonder what his sword looks like. Oh, what the? It's like an upside down face. What did you say? Ashi, 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 Sogi, Jizo. That name just sounds like Jizz. Ashi, Jo, Ashi, Jo, Ashi. Forget it. You know, the blade, the blade, the face. That game is out of my league. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Well, actually, I'm not gonna lie. That's not actually that surprising. Seeing how he literally just bodied his own squad like what was it five or six dudes just now as bombs. So yeah, actually not that surprising. Damn though, but his lieutenant? <laughs> Um, hey, yo! Bro, this man is really out there! Oh, you're apologizing to this fuck? Bro! My man is on something, huh? Also, bro, I just... Look at Uryu's arm, bro. That shit's like bent the other way around. That shit really got him, too. This body which I created. Watch it be some numbers. Oh, oh, it's not numbers. It's the actual name. I was about to... PX 20,300... You know? Nemo what? Uh, by melding the... Quint, quint of my Gigai technique and dry cont. Yeah, okay, yep. I know Gigai. I don't know what the other one is. Still, though, damn, bro. Yep. I mean, no shit. That looks like a deep ass cut. Oh. oh okay okay i thought it was just that deep of a cut to the point where it's like just that just there oh damn so you can't control it but you can still feel pain damn yeah i don't think she's getting up bro he's on fucking demon time bro Oh, 
don't even think it's about being a Quincy or not, bro. It's just being about like you're just bullying the fucking weak at this point. But he really does not like Quincy's heart. This is a story of my hardships, bro. Bro, who the fuck asked, bro? Who actually asked? Wait. Oh. Yeah, you're talking to the wrong person about that shit. Uryu's about to go ham on your ass, bro. Oh, yup. That's his grams. He really said that he purposely delayed the rescue and shit too, right? Damn. Oh, oh look at Uryu. Oh. Ooh. You know he's on a saucy level when that that dramaticness kicks in because so far we've only seen that from people who are captains or captain level, aka Ichigo. Ishida, Ishida Uryu. Oh, Uryu Ishida. Oh, look at him. Oh, she's still alive too. It seems like. Talk your shit. Talk your shit. I mean, you don't you don't really have much of a choice because he's not letting you get away. So you have to kill him or you die. Also, he's not taking it seriously. Ooh. Okay. Alrighty. I'm not gonna lie. That was another dope episode from Bleach 2. Nobody's surprised that Bleach is going super fast and they're getting into another fight. Also, I'm not gonna lie. I really, really, really do not like this captain dude. And he reminds me of Orochimaru. He's, he seems like he's got some stretching abilities and shit, but except, uh, you know, Orochimaru actually stretches his body parts. He seems like he's like part of his body might be like a half android type shit because it seemed like it was like metal stuff yeah, and that was extending, you know, da -da 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 and shit. But then again, he also has shit that can heal him completely and shit. And then, yeah, but he's also super fucked up because it seems like, oh, no, actually, I don't know. Because I uh, he said he made the girl, right? So I guess that is his creation. But still, bro, like you're fucking bullying the girl. He And the other ones was not even his creation. The other ones were actual soul reapers, right? Like he just bodied like five or six of them. And he said, bro, uh, Bombs that are launched out should not come back and shit without exploding or some shit like that. I, don't quote me on it. He says something similar, right? Which is fucked up, bro. My man does not give a fuck about any of his subordinates, it seems like. So, yeah, uh, totally like fucking Orochimaru, who, to nobody's surprise. But either way, again, if you do want to watch all these videos fully uncut and up to a month early before they go live on YouTube for everybody else, without that anime transparency filter and full audio and everything, first link down in the description to my Patreon. Check it out. I would appreciate it as well. It also helps your boy stay full time and upload as many reactions as I do for you guys every single week. And apart from that, bye. Have a great day. Take care. And I'll see you guys later.